Hi there, students. A grip, to grip. If you grip something, you hold it, yeah? A tennis racket has a grip. It's the, the bit that you hold on to, okay? A child grips his parents' hands, okay? And in English, we have two phrases. To get a grip on something and to get to grips with something. Now, they're slightly different. I would say to get a grip on yourself. But to get to grips with yourself would be slightly different. Okay, if you get to grips with something, you understand it. You know how to use it. At the beginning, you are something is unfamiliar. And then you get to grips with it. But if something is out of control, then you need to get a grip on it. You need to find some way of holding it. Okay, and that's the idea. Yeah? If you're getting to grips with, you're handling it well. But if you get a grip on, you're trying to grab it. I couldn't get a grip on the rope and it ran out of my hand. Okay? So, to get to grips with, to be able to use more adeptly, more agilely, with more familiarity. Where to get a grip on, to try to control in any way. Okay? So there you go. Enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating. Subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. To get to grips with, to get a grip on.